Hello everyone. I would like to take a next couple of minutes to give a little insight into the course Master of Science in Systems Engineering and Engineering Management at South Westphalia University of Applied Sciences. Myself, Hanok Verkis, is a student at this university and I've finished my two semesters. I'm currently doing my internship and will soon be starting my thesis. Let me first talk a little about the university. Fakokshule Südwestfalen was founded in 2002. Earlier it was a part of the Paderborn University. The university has five campuses in the Südwestfalen region, namely the Zost, Iserhorn, Hagen, Meschede and Ludenscheid. The Systems Engineering and Engineering Master's degree program is offered in the Zost campus. Zost is a small and peaceful town. Some of the aspects of the campus include the multicultural environment. German language classes are conducted thrice in a week for the international students. The nightlife in Zost is just okay. Nearby cities such as Dortmund, Dusseldorf has more partying atmosphere. Friendly faculty and staff provides a very close interaction between the students. The major industries in the region includes uh, Hella, DSpace, Infineon, ThyssenKorup, etc. The part-time opportunities are comparatively less as the town is very small. However, students work with the professors as student assistants or work in MACD, Burger Kings, Kuchenmeister, etc. The knowledge of German is important if you are looking for jobs outside the university. Let me talk a little about the Systems Engineering and Engineering Management course. This course is best suited for graduates who have gained some work experience through internship or otherwise. There is also an option to obtain a double master's degree in cooperation with the University of Bolton, UK. However, in this scenario, the student has to spend one semester at University of Bolton. The master course has four major pathways, uh, namely the mechanical, the electrical, the mechatronics and the renewable pathway. Since I'm from the mechanical pathway, I'll be focusing mostly on the same. The major subjects in mechanical systems pathway is the advanced production engineering, a really fascinating module in which the focus will be on lean production systems and process optimization. Intelligent system module focus on the application of neural networks and expert systems. Monitoring of mechanical system deals with the concept of system analysis such as condition monitoring, model analysis and spectral analysis. Advanced control technology focuses on application of control systems in industrial automation. Frequency response, state space approach and fuzzy systems are the main focus of this module. The management modules includes integrated management, project management, business and engineering and technical publications and presentations. These modules does not have a written exam as such, which is kind of a good thing. However, throughout the semester, you will be working on group assignments and presentations. All these management subjects are common for all the pathways. MOMS or monitoring of mechanical systems and advanced control technology is considered to be the most challenging modules for this course. After the second semester, students usually include a voluntary internship before they start their thesis. Students have got internship in companies such as Heller, Daimler, Robert Bosch, St. Gobain, etc. This would sum up the course structure for systems engineering and engineering management. And if you want to know more about the course or know about the application process to the university, register at FS2YM with a premium plan. I can provide you with my WhatsApp number. We can have Skype sessions and will also help in editing your SOP, LOR, CV, etc. Subscribe to our FS2YM channel as well as like our Facebook page for more informative videos. Thank you.